Last time on Pokemon Infinite Fusion. Finally! Oh my gosh, you have no idea how annoying you are to find. Alright, time to bring back in Useless to deal with Marlon Weans. Wargy. You're no longer cute. Tell me, I'm in constant pain. And now, part three. Yo, Blue, you still struggling along back here? Um, yeah, <laughs> I'm not struggling. I'm doing great. I caught a bunch of strong and smart Pokemon. Yeah, you're not doing a challenge like I am, Dan. Let's get real here. Hey, let me see what you caught, Blue. You're challenged by rival Dan? Nidoto. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, actually. It's level 20. Oh, no. You're about the only thing that's not going to get completely ruined by this. But the problem is... Yeah. What, what can I do against it? It's part flying type, and my best move is... Look, 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 look. I could probably weaken its defense and... I don't know. Hit it a few times with someone else. That's probably the best I can go for. But there's absolutely no way in hell I'm going to win this. I will admit though, this fusion is actually piquing my interest. I probably might unfuse Nidoran with... Well, sorry, Nidorino with Nidorano. And Pidgeotto and Squirtle... Water Turtle. God, I keep forgetting who I'm using. I'll unfuse those guys. And probably fuse those to make something like this. But with Nidorino... Nidorano with Pidgeotto... And War Turtle with Need a Rhino. I don't even know why I'm keeping this thing in. Like, there's, there's no way Zucop's winning this. I, I should have spent the time to train. No, you know what? I'm, I'm sending useless in. It's got to be done. It's got to be done. Cannot, like, lose any Pokemon. I mean, I probably will end up losing one of my Pokemon. He's using a Super Potion. Okay, we're not doing too bad with the attacks. I mean, if I had a Water Gem, that would have been better. Because I've been finding loads of gems when I was in Mount Moon. But none of them were Water Gems, unfortunately. Okay, now the problem here is... 13 HP in this thing knows Fury Attack, but this thing is also dying. Now, I could risk a Quick Attack because it has been stuck with Leer, so I'm thinking maybe Quick Attack might kill it. However, there is also the off chance that it uses Quick, quick Attack and it gets a crit and kills me. So the question is, do I Quick Attack or do I use a Potion? I'm going to risk a Quick Attack. That was a good risk. Well done, me. Hollyhoot is close to evolving. Mantata. Okay. I might have just gotten very lucky here because I know Confusion and Peck, but I'm going to hit you with Confusion in those Hyper Fang, it's all over. Seismic Toss, that's just adding insult to injury, using a weak attack on me to finish me off. Okay, well, luckily none of my Pokemon leveled up to evolve yet, so I'm just going to have to take a loss for this because there is absolutely no way in hell I'm with- Look, you flinched. What the hell? Oh. Okay, I don't know why I quite like this. This looks very evil. I like it. I, I'm keeping it. Okay, as cool as that looks. Oh my god, it's not blue. But Jesus Christ, look at this thing. Nido Tortle. That looks amazing. Okay, do you know what? They're both equally as cool. This reminds me of an Adamantos from Final Fantasy. Warino. This actually looks really good. Okay, now that I have a fifth member and my team are essentially a bit stronger, I'm going to go and take on Dan again. See if I can win this time. See, his Nidoto ruined my team, essentially, but now that I've got something different, I should be fine. Oh, and I'm faster than it as well. Interesting. How many times have I won it? Two times. Yay. Thanks very much. You watch this thing send out Zuma. It's like I'm Nostradamus. <laughs> Come on, big damage. I want to see a lot of hits. Critical hit, that's nice. Three times. God damn it. Okay, one more than before, but whatever. It's only hitting, like, on average, two times out of the three times I've used it. That's really irritating, like. Come on. Let's go for four, at least. Three. Okay, maybe not. Who have I got to sacrifice to get four hits out of Fury for attack? Seriously, three. That has well winded me again. Uh, you know Zen Headbutt now instead of Confusion, so... If I can get this to land, it might be good. Wow, okay. Five times, that's nice. I've only been averaging three. Jesus Christ, that's flipping irritating. Okay, he's withdrawing him. Come on, bring up the, the rat. You have a base Abra. See, Abra is essentially his version of my Zuma, except it's a hell of a lot stronger. And as far as I'm aware, it evolves into something better. Oh, uh, you've just allowed Nidoto to go to his death. <laughs> Poor Nidoto. Okay, this is going to be the Mantata. That's it, right. Uh, as I said, I've got no worries now because I have got Zen Headbot. Problem is, Hollyhoot's accuracy is frigging horrendous. Okay. Uh, Gust. I don't know why I was trying to go for quick attack when Gust is right next to the attack I need. Alright, one more of these. That'll be sorted. Easy out. Would have been nice to still have my Polyhoot, but whatever. What the hell's wrong with its face? It's level 21 and you've still got it as a Bulbasaur. <laughs> this just looks like a crime against nature. No, this isn't even Bulbasaur. It's Charmander. It still is. It's, it's, it's Ivysaur now. Why did I think that was... 
it hasn't evolved into Charmeleon for some reason. The damn thing knows Dragon Rage though, so that's gonna make me rage. Because that's like 40 hit points of damage in one go. Oh no, not Razor Leaf. Oh Jesus, it was a crit as well. Why would you miss you? Oh. Great, yeah, fantastic. That was so fun. God damn it. I might just have to start using Bite on this thing, just purely because it's doing more damage. Now see, it's using Whirlwind now. Um, my theory is now it's either going to heal itself or it's going to want to fight. It's going to want to fight. Okay, it's at this point that it's now going to want to heal itself, but I'm not going to let Wing die because I at least want to try and let it level up. But once again, you're my cannon fodder. Don't know why I didn't use it as cannon fodder before. Like, I completely forgot what his role was. Okay, now the question is, are you going to whirlwind me? Or am I going to be fast enough to hit Bite off before you can do anything? Never mind, you're going to try and Poison Sting me. Don't know why. I guess that's just a set of Dragon Rage. Right, I'm going to bet your next Pokemon is going to be Mantata. So I'm going to send out Nidoato. Called it. Nice call. That's it. Big boy damage. Get rid of Mantata. Get it out of my life. Come on, Abra. Chasaw. Okay, that's fine. I can still use Gust. There we go. Super effective. Okay, he's lowered my speed with Scary Face. So I'm going to hit your quick attack and hope this finishes you off. No. But there is a silver lining to this. Okay, never mind. I was going to say the silver lining was going to be I was going to send out Zuma and quick attack it, but I didn't realize it was takedown. <laughs> See, that time it was more in my favor for this fight because I didn't lose a single attack and he was the one that ended up losing all the attacks, which was better for me. So now I've just got an easy win because Abra only knows teleport. Ah, it took three attempts to beat him. No, sorry, four attempts because I'm still counting the first time I lost. Hey, take it easy. You won already. Shut up. I earned that. You there, clown. I'm in a bad mood. Tell me a joke. What Pokemon did the boy catch when he was sick with a cold? Um, I don't know. What? A Pikachu. I will murder you in your sleep one of these days. Oh my god. <laughs> what will you learn? What will you learn? Take your actions have consequences! I'm not really getting much XP from this guy's Pokemon, which is really upsetting. Like, the level difference as well between them and Dan is really irritating because Dan it was in the 20s and this guy has just barely reached over 10. I mean to be fair this is Nugget Bridge though so everyone gets stronger as I go on I hope. Yeah see look now they're level 14 so this should be better for me. All right level 16 we're starting to get up there with Polyhoo now. Luckily I'm making you flinch with Zen Headbutt if we can keep this up that's an easy win. Nice well done. Nice. Oh that was easy. Oh I like how this looks. That looks really cool. Okay, but we're dealing with an electric poison type now, so... Am I part water type? I think I am, aren't I? <laughs> yes, I am. Well, the annoying thing is I can either send out one of my two flying types or my water type. <laughs> either way, Charge Beam might end up killing me. <laughs> okay, so yeah. Voltorb is extremely fast. It's even fast when it evolves. But we got Quick Attack, and that's going to be your downfall. Congratulations, you just beat our five contest trainers. You've earned a fabulous prize. You've obtained the nugget, thank you very much. I know the trick here is to make him beat me, but I don't want to do that, I don't want to waste any time. By the way, would you like to join Team Rocket? We're a group dedicated to evil using Pokemon. Want to join? Hell yeah, I do. Great, you can just sign here and... Wait, aren't you the kid who was messing with us in Mount Moon? Uh, I mean, I didn't really mess with you. I just accidentally stumbled onto what you were doing, said nothing, and your machine blew up. I had nothing to do with any of this. I take Martha back. We don't want no troublemakers in our organization. Oh yeah, God forbid having someone evil in your evil organization. Let's see what you got, Ekans. He's using glare. God flipping damn it. I hate it when they do that. Come on, don't be paralyzed. Just kill him. Get him out of my sight. Now, lucky thing is, I know Team Rocket use poison Pokemon. <laughs> Oh no, that's even worse than the other thing, I think. <laughs> I don't know what it is about giving Zubat eyes with Pokemon like this. It's just it's just so funny for no reason. Come on, don't you dare hit yourself. Good. Well done. Bellsprout. <gasps> I'm just thinking. Catch this and fuse it with my other Zubat. Or possibly something else that's going to be blue. And we've got something for Misty's Gym. Ah, here we go. Okay, um, we'll try this one. <laughs> Okay, here we go. This one was one that I didn't try out, so hopefully you're going to be the one that looks more like Zubat. <laughs> oh dear god, it's a Xenomorph. Zeusprout. Ugh, disgusting. Ew! Oh no! 
Oh, that looks disgusting. That's like a, a manatee fused with mushrooms. Oh, that's disgusting. That's something even The Last of Us wouldn't like to use. Okay, Zookarp can now evolve into whatever the Gyarados fusion is going to be called. And we have another Venonat fusion. What, what's with the Venonats all of a sudden? Okay, well, he's not part poison type, so he's just bug ground. It's a fine to finish it off and get it out of my sight. Nasty looking creature. Oh no, it's already looking terrible. Oh dear. <laughs> Guys, who turned out the lights? I can't see. You never could see Gyarados. 2023, 5th, 15th. Oh, it actually records the date. That's actually pretty cool. Experiment number 32. I will now test the subject's effects using DNA splices on a human by using it on myself and this ride on. I don't think that's a good idea, buddy. Oh, uh, he's already done it. Never mind. That's no good. That's no good at all. Oh my god. Does it have his face on ride on? This, 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 I, I don't want to be in this furry's house. I'm leaving. Sorry, I'm leaving you to suffer. I hate furries. Of course, I can't progress through the story without actually helping you, which is irritating. You didn't see that, did you? It doesn't matter if I saw that. I'm looking at you now. Okay, I'll admit it. I was conducting research on Pokemon Fusion, but I might have screwed up. In what way, do you reckon? Hey, what's with that skeptical look? I'm not joshing you. I really need your help. So how about it? Help me out here. Yeah, sure, why not? When I'm in a teleporter, I go to my PC and run cell separation system. Uh, you, you haven't told me what button. H hello, excuse me, person. What I, what, what button do I press? Oh dear God. Okay. Um, I, I, I hope it's this one. Yeah, thanks, bud. I owe you one. So, um, do we, do we just ignore the fact that Rhydon is now missing? You obtained the SS ticket. There we go. Now I can go on the SSN, but I won't be able to do anything until I beat Misty. So I'll be going to do that next. Oh, okay. They've got her anime outfit from when she. Released her Togepi, I think. I mean, it looked like that. It was yellow anyway. Okay, we have a level 21 Jiggly Dean. What a fairy type. Start off by putting you to sleep. Horn attacks want to kill me. Yep. Start off by putting me to sleep. <laughs> okay, uh, we'll, we'll use Absorb, <laughs> which is going to do absolutely nothing because Jigglypuff is super tanky for no reason. God forbid what her next Pokemon is going to be because I'm not liking this fusion because of how easily it took out the Pokemon that I said I needed and how slowly it's going down, even against a super effective attack. Oh sweet Jesus, now it's sung me to sleep. I'm not going to wake up for a while either, that's the thing. Now this is going to confuse me, you watch. Okay, never mind. But I know for a fact that is going to confuse me in probably the next hit. Do not use sing, do not use sing. Okay, good. Jesus Christ, that's so powerful. I mean, do you know what? I would have that. It's kind of cute and it's blue colored. But the problem is... I'm dying. All right, we're gonna waste our super potion. See what we do here. Mega drain. Oh no, please don't do much. Okay, we're good. So your parts, uh, grass type. I'm gonna try air cutter. See how much damage we can do. Oh, that was vicious. One more and you're dead. I'll bury you. I hate you. I knew that was gonna confuse me eventually. And look at that, he hits himself. Of course. Right when we're one hit away from victory. God damn it, making me waste all of my potions. How can so much cute be so much power? It's so annoying. Do not hit yourself, do not hit yourself, do not hit yourself. Uh, I'm so glad you snapped out of it long enough for it to now survive the hits. Thank you very flipping much, Garabat. God damn. Guess I'm using my full restore. I'm not I, I can't believe I had to use that many that many potions. Like I, I got completely sidewinded there. That was so annoying. You want to confuse me again? Never mind. Okay. I'll take that win. Even though I probably shouldn't have deserved it. <laughs> oh no. They've replaced its legs for, for its tail. Oh dear. I might have to reverse the fusion again and see what happens. I'm going to reverse your fusion yet again and see if you'll be any better from the other side. I don't think you will because, yeah, it's already looking bad. <laughs> I might have to unfuse these two and just keep Gyarados. Oh my god. <laughs> hey guys, I found some really cool stuff and I smoked it. It's all good. Another Pidgey. Okay, throwaway Pidgey number two. Hey, I am back with my throwaway Pidgey for this wonder trade. Let's hope it's something that's blue. I'm not allowed to unfuse it or reverse the fusion, which is really annoying. Okay, you're a Slugma Bonsly. Interesting. How's that going to look when it evolves into Magcargo and Sudowoodo? I'm not going to find that out because they're not blue. But anyway, that's where I'm going to end it. This has been quite a long episode because of everything I've been doing. So yeah, that was uh, eventful. 
but whatever. We got the badge. We finally beat Blue after four attempts. That was fun. And the next thing to do will be to go on the SS Anne and take on Lieutenant Surge. So if you enjoyed, like, subscribe and comment, and I'll see you again for the next part.